Now we're getting reports that the special prosecutor in the Benazir Bhutto murder case has been killed. According to police, unknown gunmen opened fire on Zulfikar Ali's car in Islamabad. Well, Kamal Haider joins me now on the line from Islamabad. Kamal, what else do we know? Yeah, we know at the moment that Chaudhary Zulfikar was on his way to the anti-terrorist court where he was uh, said to be presenting new evidence. However, as he left his residence located in sector G9 of Islamabad along with a guard, he came under fire from unknown gunmen or riding a motorcycle. He was killed on the spot. However, his guard is said to be badly wounded and the uh, hospital staff is trying to save his life. Now, interestingly, uh, this is the special prosecutor for the government, as you mentioned, in the Benazir Bhutto murder case that, that has made headlines after the return of the former military ruler who is under detention right now in that particular case. So uh, a, a very uh, interesting development, but at the same time, it also shows that the security apparatus is not working. This is a man who should have been provided maximum security. There will be question marks as to how just one guard was riding with him. Absolutely. And of course, it's all happened uh, just in the last half hour or so. But Kamal, has there been any claims of responsibility? Do you expect any claims of responsibility to come in? It's going to be very difficult because this is a man who was obviously not on the list of the Tariqa Taliban Pakistan. They normally do take responsibility when they conduct bombings across Pakistan or targeted killings. But it is unlikely that this has happened uh, from anywhere else. It, it would appear that there is some sort of a conspiracy within the country uh, that would want to silence this particular man. And Kamal, of course, all this happening, what, just over a week before the elections, is this likely to affect the elections at all? It is not going to have any effect on the election because you have to remember that a number of senior leaders have been killed. Uh, many political parties have been given warnings by the Tariqa Taliban in Pakistan. The Pakistani military chief speaking recently to his soldiers also said that nobody should have any illusions about the elections not happening. So the elections are on track despite the fact that there is a threat that there will be more lives lost. But the people are hell-bent on the election because this is a crucial election for Pakistan. Kamal Haider there in Islamabad bringing us up to date with that breaking news story. The special prosecutor in the Benazir Bhutto murder case has been killed. Thank you very much, Kamal.